Oh yeah. Let's go ahead and try this out. Oh man, this made a mess, huh? Oh, not good, not good, not good. What is going on, you guys? This is DJ Overspin, and today I was, uh, you know, searching around in a um, Korean, or not Korean, but like an Oriental uh, store and everything, and uh, I just, I, I was thinking to myself, like, I want to try, uh, you know, like noodles or, or kimchi, you know, I already know what kimchi tastes like, I know what gimpop tastes like, um, but... I, I came across a video of someone actually eating this stuff, and uh, I thought I, I'd try it out too. So this is a uh, sweet, uh, uh, spicy and sweet tteokbokki, and uh, I'm going to be trying this out, and um, I'm sorry if it's backwards on here and everything, because uh, my camera, I can't use my, my regular camera up there, it's, it's kind of messed up now. But uh, yeah, when I put it in the microwave and everything, I was hoping that it wasn't... Uh, gonna spew over maybe i should have just like let it cook for like two and a half minutes instead of three uh i i just don't even know the rating of my uh what was it my microwave and whatnot so um let me try separating this clunk right here there you go that's separated right no it ain't but yeah i'm gonna be uh trying this out oh there's another piece uh stuck together <clears throat> so um i'm sorry if the background is just green uh this is my green screen that i use for like streaming video games whenever i want to stream video games um but if i want to in this video i could just like sit there and put like an awesome background to this video but uh you know I might as well just like leave it like it is and whatnot. So um, here it is. It's a little bit spewed over and whatnot. The the spicy and sweet topoki. Um, I'm gonna try it out. You know, it looks pretty appetizing <laughs> as far as I can tell. But let me try it out. That ain't too bad. It's a little bit on the on the spicy side, but you know, topoki is actually really good. Um, I really don't know what it consists of because I'm still trying to learn Korean um, to see what exactly what it's made of. Maybe if I read the ingredients on the package, then I would know exactly what topoki is. But other than that, it ain't too bad. It's kind of like a, um, what was it? It's, it's like a noodle. It's almost like a noodle, um, but just only fat. And it's got the, the type of spice that is found in a certain type of food that I cannot place. But it's really good. These Koreans, you know, they, they have really good tasting and everything. Ain't too bad. But, um, you know, I also got other things as well that I want to try. And one of them, my boss basically told me that I shouldn't eat it before going to work. Or at least eat it while I'm at work. I asked him why. He's like, well, you're going to be visiting the uh, the toilet, like, often and everything. And it's not good for you. And your stomach is really going to hurt the next day. So I was like, well, I guess I'll try it on a Saturday and see how well it goes. Uh, I went out and I got some kimchi along with it because uh, from what I heard so far, I'm not sure if this is true, but what I heard so far is whenever you cook... Um, Oh, is it? It's, um, uh... God, it's like, it's like noodles. It's like ramen noodles, but they, they have a specific word for it. I can't think of the word now because I'm still trying to learn Korean. 
but um yeah you you cook it it's like really really spicy and you cook it with kimchi afterwards and it, or with it i heard either with it or afterwards but i think it's with it um you can also have like uh spam and all sorts of different vegetables with it too um I'm gonna try it out. I'm gonna try cooking some and uh, see how it is. One of my friends that's on Facebook with me, um, she said that um, she, it, you know, she loves Korean. She's Korean as well, but she loves Korean. I was telling her what I want to do, and she's like, "Man, you're making me crave Korean." And I'm like, "Well, you know, if I get the um, the money and everything, I'm." get all the ingredients to get all the ingredients together and make my way over to her place and cook for her and her family of course i can't cook in my house because nobody in my house likes korean except for me oh man this is really good i'm gonna finish this up but uh let me go ahead and um get the um the stuff that i got real quick it's not going to take long there's only a few bags all right so i'm back um so let me open let me take these this thing out. I'll throw that away but um a few things that uh i got was the uh, hot chicken flavored ramen noodles. Um, it says it's really spicy. It's spicy, but it's tolerable. Um, you know, I'm gonna be trying this eventually. Um, let me move into texture over here. But uh, you know, it said, you know, it's spicy. Like all the other noodles from you know Korea are all spicy. All, all you know, anything this brand. This is the uh, Samyang uh, brand and uh i'm gonna be trying this one uh along with the the same thing same brand but this is the one with cheese what, what's this one? Oh, this was this one's made with a uh, mala uh or the mala flavor i think uh to add extra spice <clears throat> i got this one which is like the cheese one and uh it's spicy but it's supposed to be a little bit less spicy because of the cheese and whatnot so i think you add the cheese yourself on this one um i also bought uh some uh korean seaweed uh snack this comes with wasabi and uh i actually had one pack of this and you know i completely forgot what wasabi tasted like i haven't had it oh sorry i haven't had that in a long time so i was like you know I gotta buy this and everything so i was like i i bought it and i tried it and i talked to my boss about it i was like you know i had this stuff and everything i forgot about how how spicy wasabi is and everything and he's like yeah think of the wasabi times 100 of the noodles that i bought or whatever whatever it's called i can't remember um let me see um uh boo uh boo mm. Bull, bull, uh, bull, uh, bulldog, bulldog, bulldog. <laughs> See, I'm, I'm reading this and everything. I'm reading this. I'm like, okay, bull, dog. <laughs> yeah, bull dog. So this is the one that my boss told me is a big no and everything. I was like, why? You know, it's like it's it's spicy. I love spicy and everything. He's like, no. You're, you're gonna have a stomach ache. It's really, it's not good and everything. I was like, oh, come on, you know, it can't be that bad. He's like, no, this is horrible. You eat it, you're gonna be like freaking sitting on the toilet constantly and whatnot, and fire is gonna come out and you're gonna regret it, and the next day your stomach is gonna hurt. And I was like, that's a challenge. First, yeah, worth taking, you know, I'll just, I'll, I'll, um, I'll fire up my my uh my stove and everything i'll pop this in a pot along with uh some kimchi uh 
you know, you're, uh, you can add peppers to it, uh, red peppers. Um, but I, I really don't know if I want to add some chili peppers in there. Uh, the Korean chili peppers, at least. Um, but um, I would I would try... Um, I would try the, the 2X spicy... Uh, bo uh, um, bo God damn. I just had the word, too. But uh, I'm going to try that out. Um, and I'm going to finish this up. This is actually really good. You know, I just can't believe how... I mean, you can look at it. It's like a fat noodle. I mean, look at my finger. I mean, it's about the same size. <laughs> but it's not too bad, you know. Not bad at all. And I'm going to finish this up. And I'm going to edit this video. And I'm going to upload it for you guys. But, uh... Yeah. Really good. Um, I'm going to buy a lot of different types of variety of noodles. And... Uh, go out and get that big old this Korean store like let me let me tell you this story I go into the or not Korean store but it's like a oriental market and um, this um, there's this refrigerator dedicated towards uh, both um, Korean um, vegetables and uh, like other other stuff as well but they don't have a uh, gimpop and gimpop was like one of the things i wish that they actually had in there but uh as i was sitting there looking around i saw kimchi and they have a big old jar of kimchi bear in mind it's a pretty good bit of money for kimchi now let me show you the jar that i got Yes, I have a fridge in my room, and this is the jar I got. It's about the same size as like a mason jar, but um, it's it's full of kimchi. It's not the cabbage kimchi. It's um, some other kimchi uh, vegetable, but um, but this <laughs> is really good, and I love kimchi. I love it to death. And I'll just have some right now. Oh man, my my screen just turned on. Didn't mean to do that, but uh, yeah, kimchi, really, really good. If I can actually manage to grab one, mm. really good. Mm. I try not having too much of it because I love kimchi, and the thing is that in my area kimchi this kimchi is actually homemade uh in this market so that that is awesome uh in my area because i love kimchi i love to eat kimchi and this you know i i could possibly eat this every single day you know and i'll try i'll try the noodles too let me see if i can cook some of that with the kimchi and see how everything is um but the big old thing, you know, this was actually eight dollars, which ain't well, not eight dollars. It's like about eleven dollars. I think it's like eleven eleven dollars for it. I really, I'm really not sure because I didn't even look at the um, the receipt. I just bought it and just ran with it. But um, yeah, I, I saw the big old jar and everything, and that price. I'm not gonna. <laughs> I'm not going to say what the price was, but it was really expensive. So I'm like, you know what? This is what I'm going to do. I'm going to get me the small jar. And when I have more money and everything, I'll get the bigger jar. But I'm going to buy more more noodles. I'm going to buy more of this um, tapoki. Enjoy myself with uh, this tapoki. Man, this is really good. It's not spicy at all. Well, it is spicy, but it's actually like you can taste the sweet and you can taste the spicy in it, but it's not really spicy. 
but at least I know in my house, <laughs> I'm going to keep this in the pantry in the kitchen because nobody's going to touch uh, this um, bull duck, bull duck, bull duck, there it is. So the bull duck, you know, I'll just, I'll keep in the pantry in there. There's no, there's no reason to actually keep it in, uh, in my room, per se, and uh, I gotta re readjust my chopsticks a bit. I'm still trying to learn how to use chopsticks because son of a bitch. <laughs> but uh, anyways, that's me trying the um, the bukaki. <laughs> the tapoki. That's me trying to tapoki. And um, I hope you enjoyed this video. Please leave a like and subscribe. Comment down below of what kind of food that I should try. Uh, if you are Korean watching this and understand English, but cannot type very well in English. You can type Korean in the comments. I, I, I have no problems with it. Uh, that would be very appreciated. Um, and But yeah, that's, that's basically it for today. I'm going to go ahead and upload this to my computer. I'm going to edit it a bit. And, uh, you know, if you already watched, well, actually you already watched it. So that, that intro part is pretty awesome. But anyways, thank you for watching. And, um, annyeong.